Hello, this is Jimmy and you are watching the Elementary Info YouTube channel. If you are looking for a herpes cure, visit the website link in this video's description and in the first comment. Herpes in kidneys. Herpes simplex virus, HSV infection, can also affect the kidneys, although it's less common compared to other manifestations such as oral or genital herpes. When herpes affects the kidneys, it typically occurs in the context of disseminated herpes infection, which is a severe form of the disease where the virus spreads throughout the body. Here's how herpes can impact the kidneys. Disseminated herpes infection. In some cases, particularly in individuals with weakened immune systems, herpes simplex virus can spread beyond the initial site of infection and affect multiple organs, including the kidneys. This dissemination of the virus can lead to serious complications, including kidney involvement. Herpetic nephritis, herpes nephritis or herpetic nephritis, refers to inflammation of the kidneys due to herpes simplex virus infection. This condition can lead to symptoms such as flank pain, blood in the urine, hematuria, protein in the urine, proteinuria, fever, and general feelings of illness. Immune system compromise. Individuals with compromised immune systems, such as those with HIV AIDS or undergoing immunosuppressive therapy, are at higher risk of developing disseminated herpes infection, including kidney involvement. In these cases, herpes can cause more severe and widespread complications, including renal dysfunction. It's important to note that while herpes can affect the kidneys, it's relatively rare and typically occurs in the context of disseminated infection or in individuals with compromised immune function. Most cases of herpes infection involve the skin, mucous membranes, or central nervous system.